Hello, this is Carol from my site wizard.org and today's tutorial is how to create a slideshow. And um, yeah, this really puts in some pizzazz into your website. So let's look at this. We're first of all going to see how to upload photos from the file manager. If you haven't covered that before, then you need to look at the tutorial simply called Uploading Photos. We're going to change the order of the photos appearing in our slideshow, change the names of the photos, and change the timings. So let's get started. We're going to start with a blank canvas so you can actually see how to get all of the functions that you need. Okay, as before, what we're going to do is go to Insert, go to Image, go to Library. It's in our Library File Manager that we're going to find these functions. We're going to go to Library. And now we're going to go down to Image Tools and we're going to choose Slideshow. And here's the example. Okay, we're going to now get out of this. Move this in here so you can see it a little better. And now we're going to actually load some images. I'm going to add an image. It takes me back to my file manager. I'm going into library. And now I'm going to choose images. You would have your own private images that you would have loaded and they would be appearing in my files. But these are existing photos. I'm going to do a site uh, slideshow that is perhaps on travels. And you can keep adding them here. Pretty quickly done. You can see how they're loading at the bottom of this bar. Uh, beach couple. I'm just going to get a couple of them up here so you can see. Uh, we don't want that one. Don't want. Uh, okay, let's see what else we have. City lights. That's fine. And we'll stop with that. Okay, now what we're going to do, we're going to look at the first element of the editor, which allows us to either make it wider or higher. I've explained in uploading photos what this means, so let's just dig a little more. We've done add images. Now let's organize them. There's this really nifty little tool. And if you already have a slideshow and want to get rid of some of them, again you go to the little icon, garbage bin, which is the delete. Now let's say I want to put the beach one above Ayers Rock. I move it up one. Let's say I want city lights at the top. If you see that it's moving to position 4, 3, 2, 1 and it's up at the top. And what we can do then is I'm just going to apply that. If you look down here you'll see some changes occurring. And now what we're going to do is get out of this little one and we're going to go to Advanced. And this looks at the actual um, the main image that appears in the type of aspect ratio. I'm not going to go into that. Captions, I like the captions to be there. The padding is a space around here. You can adapt that. We're going to go to more. This is pretty neat. This regulates the actual speed in which the slides are shown, the intervals behind them. I tend to keep that pretty short and I'm going to have it at three seconds. Let's say this was a business tutorial and uh, you were explaining different concepts to a client, maybe about a product, and you had audio running, you might want it slower. So you can adapt that. You can apply that. And now we're going to go to Setup. You can add music if you want to. You just have to browse inside your, your files that you have, maybe existing audio files or it might be one of the files that already are in the library and there's scats of them there. Uh, so you can take a look at that later and now we're going to go to the actual style. 
So we're looking at the actual colors. I've used gray on gray to go with this site. I'm going to try this lime color up here so you'll be able to see that. Whoa, that's a bit crazy, isn't it? Maybe for some of your sites that might be usable, but you get the general idea. Let's say I want to make it a lighter color, or let's look at gray into a more finer detail of the colors, the kind of gray I want, and let's say it's a little lighter. You can see how it changes up there. We apply it. There we go. So I'm going to get out of that and out of this. And now what we're going to look at is actually what it looks like because it's finished. So I come over here, I click on my site, and here you have your new slideshow. Timed at three seconds per picture. We've got the lighter padding or color around it. The padding's about a 15. And there you go. We also have the pause button up here. So we have that evident. It could be hidden. We could also change if we want to have the pictures up at the top. You could have the pictures up at the top. Huge amount of flexibility. It's fun to use. I hope you will have a chance to actually utilize these. Please leave me, leave me a rating. I love getting those. It's motivating. If you'd like more helpful uh, tutorials, video tutorials, please uh, blog me at mysitewizard.org forward slash blog. Have a great life. Bye.